We're pleased to be joined by Lee Volleyball Coach Andrea Hudson after a big Gulf South Conference victory over Union tonight, 3-1. to one. And Coach, guys bounce back. This is the second time around with the conference now, second half of the conference schedule, and a good way to start it off with a victory tonight. Absolutely, and we've kind of laid out in front of the girls what the second half of the conference has to look like for us. Um, we're on one of the only sports in the conference that only has six teams that go to the tournament. Most of them have eight, and we – so that window is very small, and all of the teams seem to be beating up on each other this year, which is a little better than just having a full top half. So I think they got inspired tonight, and I think they're ready to play. Now, a couple of players that stood out to me, Catherine Conley and Michaela Beebe, two players that uh, you really relied on today. Kath, uh, uh, Conley in the first part of the match really had some big-time kills, and then Beebe getting the aces and also playing big on the defensive end. Talk about the importance of those two tonight. Well, you know, we've been encouraging our middles to get in the offense. I mean, we, we've told them they have two jobs. They have to get up and block and then turn around and get ready to attack. Kat was on fire with that tonight. And her, um, I think she hit 333 for the night. And so, you know, some teams will lock up on Kat. And that happened to her over the weekend. You know, people had been seeing her and – so we had some teams that just kind of basically stopped her, but we had to deliver the ball elsewhere. And then on top of that, in order for the medals to ever, you know, be successful, it takes that back row. And uh, Michaela was really, really playing well tonight. I was really proud of her. Um, her first year as a libero, but she's really stepped up. Coach, thanks so much. Best of luck on the road this weekend. Thank you. It's going to be a tough one. Big road trip coming up for the Lady Flames. They'll head to North Alabama and Alabama-Huntsville this weekend. They'll be back at home a week from today against Christian Brothers at 7 p.m.